So I'm here with Tyree Saunders of the First Coast Buccaneers. Tyree, start off by telling us your, your grade and what sports you play. Yes, uh, I'm a senior, and I play football, basketball, and also run track. Football, basketball, and track. So you're balancing three sports, very accomplished in, in all three. So you got that and social life and family life and grades. How do you balance all of that? Just my family supporting me through it all, you know, just helping me whenever I need it. And also for God, I'm going to give me my ability to be able to play all three sports and stay healthy throughout all three. So it's just, you know, it's a lot of hard work. It's just working hard, you know, almost all, the, all day, every day, taking certain days off. But just, just believing in myself and believing in the confidence I get, you know, to be able to do good in all three. And I was just highly blessed to be able to do it. So Tyree has a fat ring on his finger. So Tyree, go ahead and show the camera the ring and what you have to do to get a piece of hardware like that. Uh, a lot of work that people don't see, you know, you know everybody have practice, everybody practices, but the word that nobody sees is the practice, the workout I do at night when everybody sleep, workouts I do on the weekends with my fam, my dad, when, you know, when, on Sundays when everybody getting ready for school. It's like just a lot of work I do with my teammates on the side. It's just a lot of work, a lot of hard work built up to that. We, we came over, we came with a lot of obstacles, and it was just challenges faces us, but, you know, we got through it, worked hard, you know, it got us to where we needed to get. So you mentioned while everybody is asleep. So you working out, you working on your craft while everybody else is taking a nap. Yes, sir. It's just nighttime workout. Also, you know, stretching your body at night before you go to sleep. A lot of people don't do that when they go to sleep. It's like just like extra stuff like push up, you know, just stuff that nobody really sees, you know, that we really don't think about like that. So that extra stuff it builds up over time and which believe you know, I could be there between winning or losing. So that's what I gotta do. So any plans after high school? Well, right after high school, I'll be going out to college. I leave for uh, Virginia Tech on June the fourteenth. I graduate May 22nd at like first was high school. So once graduation, I got like a two-week period in Jacksonville, and I'm off to college. So between those two weeks, I guess you could say, I'll be spending more time with family, just doing stuff with them before I leave because I don't want to come back until the following January. So Virginia Tech, what can they look forward to with a talent like yours? Oh, they're looking for someone who's going to get the best of me and working hard. You know, with me playing three sports, I never really concentrated on just one sport. So me going there and streaking for football, all my energy I've been putting into different sports is going to make me so much better. You know, while people are getting better in football, I've been doing basketball and track. So I feel like it's going to make me a whole way to better play than what I'm in now. And just, you're going to get a high character guy who want to win and just, just look good and make my city proud. Career aspirations. Career aspirations is, is, you know, do good in college wise, get my degree, get my business degree and my sports media degree. And then pro, I want to go professional in the NFL, but if God don't allow it, I want to have my own business and do sports media. A businessman and, a, and an accomplished athlete. Yeah. Well, Tyree, thanks for joining us today. Yeah. And thank you for joining us at this year's High School Sports Media Day, uh, presented by the First Coast YMCA and Baker Sporting Goods.